my life is for itself and not for spectacle. Emerson said that a long time ago. This was before the age of the internet and social media. Now social media has you convinced that if you don't exist online, if people aren't watching what you're doing and you don't have a big following, then you don't exist or your life doesn't matter. Let me dispel that for you right now. Here's a couple problems with it. First of all, to get attention online, you have to appeal to the masses. You gotta do things that are probably dumb, petty, ridiculous, you're a dancing monkey. Problems with that, for sure. Problems mentally with that, for sure. Where it takes you in life, who the fuck knows. You also have to dumb down your messaging. To be great is to be misunderstood, as Emerson said again, because most people during their time, they are thinking outside the box. Their ideas are revolutionary, they're innovative. And so it's not until later that they get the respect and the admiration that they deserve. The other problem with social media is that it turns you into a slave and a slave to externals, likes, comments, this, that, it messes with your mind. To become famous on social media, to really make that a goal, you do have to become obsessed with those numbers because that's what it takes to win at that game. The negative side effects of this are well understood and every day we're seeing more and more of it. This turns you into a slave tossing this way and that like a rag doll. The answer is max truth, except your responsibility for your thoughts, your inner world, everything in the outer exists because of this. It always comes back to you. You are the only omnipresence in your reality. Nobody will ever get in your mind for you. Nobody will ever make decisions for you. So you take ownership, you take control, and you figure out how to make a life for yourself, not a life for others, not a life that you think others will appreciate or value. Because when you try to solve the internal with the external, they don't fit. Internal is solved internally. It will always be that way. So if you, so when you look for answers in the external, your internal is never gonna be satisfied and you can have all the fame, money, glory, and social media following in the world and you will still be hollow inside because you have not resolved the internal. You are living in the external. The irony here is if you go to the internal and you master that, then everything in the external is gravy. It's whatever you want it to be because you've mastered the internal. And the internal is your perceptions, your biases, your beliefs, and really what reality is or isn't. It's entirely up to you. That's maximum truth. Consider a quiet life because it will be a life for you. You don't need people to be seeing you on social media for your life to matter and for you to make an impact.